sorry about the background noise. I'm at my mother-in-law's for a few days and I thought I would show you what I brought. Um, it's kind of like a kit that I made up really quickly. So I just chose like three colors that I wanted to use um, with black and white, obviously. But yeah, so I'll show you what I got, what I brought, sorry. So I just brought, let's say I brought some glue, some Heidi Swap Color Shine Gold, four washi tapes, my stapler, my paper cutter or trimmer, and then I brought some, my embellishments I brought purple. I don't have much in the way of purple, but I brought it. And then my photos are in here. And I brought brown, which crap. And I brought blue. And I brought pink. And I should have brought gold, but I didn't think about it. So yeah, and then the rest is in my iris container. Um so I brought some pot dot, obviously, and some home tape. And then I brought excess glue. This is from the dollar store and it's actually pretty decent, which is exciting. I brought black ink and my roller date stamp. I'm not planning on doing really any mixed media other than my Heidi Swell color shine and that, which I don't really count. But yeah, and then I brought this, um, the confetti ephemera and these frames. I haven't opened them yet. I don't know if I'll actually use them, but I just bought them in case I would want to. And then I brought um, some Dyson Flowers Purple, Blue, and Mint. And a little bit of twine. This is just from Paper Issues. They're a little twinery thing. Scissors. <laughs> Sharpie pen. This one's really old. I need to get a new one. And then I will show you guys and then we'll I brought a lot of stuff just in case, but it's all kind of the same colors. I'm going for purple, blue, um, and gold, and a little bit of pink here and there, and obviously black and white. Yeah. So I brought these. I don't even know what company they're by. I just have like a few left. Obviously, I won't use the yellow ones, but the other ones. I only have like big enamel dots left, which is frustrating, but I brought the freckled blonde ones. I brought the on trend ones. I brought these sprinkles from Doodlebug. I brought this one purple enamel dot from the Enchanted Enchanted by Simple Stories. I brought these puffy stickers from Pink Car Studios. These puffy stickers from Seven Paper. They don't really go with my colors, but there's a few of them, so I'll just use the ones I use. I brought these, what is it called? Chipboard sticker parts from Studio Calico. Um, these puffy stickers from Dear Lizzie, which I would like to use all of them if possible. I brought these from So Fancy. I almost used them all. I brought these from Doodlebug, which I haven't even used yet. I brought these from Simple Stories So Rad. And I brought these from My Mind's Act. So I'll use up some of those. I kind of brought products that I have less of too because I want to use some stuff. So. For tiny word stickers, it's perfectly organized. So um, I have a few here, and then there's probably gonna be more down later. But I have some craft market ones. I brought my other sheet, and I brought these two from Little Stories. And then I have um, these little, this tiny alpha from Blue Bean Soup. And then I brought a ton of photo stickers because I've been loving to use the black ones and the white ones, and I didn't even bring the gold ones or the colored ones. I brought these Revons from Kiss Kids, and then I brought a ton of sticker sheets. So I brought both of my confetti ones because I only have a little bit left. Um, it's my daughter's birthday soon, so I am planning on saving this happy birthday for that because I've already used my other one, so I probably won't be using that part, but I'll probably be using hopefully a lot. My plan is to use up a lot because I have such a small amount of stuff. Well, it's not that small, you know. This confetti sheet, I have another half of that other one. Um, this is the um, poolside sheet from Crate Paper. Obviously, there's this August that I won't be using because it's not August yet, but the rest I can use. I brought the one from Notes and Things. I brought some of the Serendipity Way. Dear Lizzie, I have more, but it's in here. These gold stickers from Open Book. 
the journey one spring crepe paper the other uh i brought the rest of the craft market stuff i have left i brought these which i haven't used any of them um from october afternoon this is the other side of the serendipity sheet i also brought this tiny alpha and i brought this sheet of words from chanel and some more tiny word stickers we've got these few From gray paper. This is the other side of the confetti sheet. And then I have a ton of thickers. I brought these ones, They're the navy ones from the full side collection. I brought these, they're not thickers, they're just the Amy Tangerine clear, whatever. <laughs> these, which are the marquee ones from Craft Market, these, I don't know what collection these are from, they're just gray. These are from Kiss Kiss. These are from Fine and Dandy. I don't know what collection this is from. They're just black. These are really old. They're just gold. And then I brought these craft ones from Amy Cadbury. And the rest is paper, so I'll show you it. So I brought three 6x6 paper pads, Serendipity by Dear Lindsay, Craft Market, and Hello Darling from Wear Memory Keepers. And then I brought some white cardstock, and then the rest is 12 by 12 papers. Um, yeah, so I'll show you those. Um, so this one's from Michael's. It's from the Craft Market collection that they have there. It's just like thin stuff. This is from actual Craft Market by Crate Paper. It's called Stitching. Yes. This is from Simple Stories. So fancy. It's called the Too Cute. We'll definitely be using this side if I use it. This one is also from So Fancy. It's called Trendy. And then this one is also from So Fancy and it's called Besties. But if I use it, I'll probably use this side. This is from Pinkrush Studio. It's called Feathers. This one is from Capture Life by Allison Craft and Echo Park. Um, it's called Hearts. This is the A side, but I would use this side. This is from Heidi Swap Dreamy, I believe. I think it's just called Dreamy Dots. Um, this is from Pink Paisley Citrus Bliss. This is from, this side is the cut apart, but I would use this side. This one is also from Pink Fresh Studios Up in the Clouds. It's called Confetti Rain. This is from the Serendipity set from Michaels. This is from that as well, as well as this one and this one. And then I also have some from the Heidi Swap. I don't remember the name of the collection, but it's from Michaels as well. It's a lot of black and white for layering mostly. I'm just showing you the sides I plan to use. And then this one as well. And then I have this gold specialty paper from Jim Hadfield Cottage Living, I think. This is another piece from the Dear Lizzie Serendipity from Michaels. This one's actually from Dear Lizzie Serendipity. This one is called I Heart To You. This one is from Webster's Pages. It is called Nature's Beauty. I would use this side though. This one is from Studio Calico Bright and Pure. I probably would use this side. I'm not sure about that one. Again, this one's from the Serendipity Collection from Michaels. This one is from Journey. I think it's called Black Bee Campers or something like that. And then this is the last one. It is from Confetti by Crate Paper. It's a specialty paper. So yeah. Um, I'm going to show you guys after, because I'm not doing process videos, I'm just going to show you my, I could do a layout share after this. Um, sorry that I don't have a tripod, but that's all I brought. It's actually a decent amount of stuff. I don't think I'll get a ton of layouts down here, but it would be exciting if I did. And I just thought I would show you guys what I brought to kind of bring part of my, um, craft, I don't know, collection stash with me. So yeah. Talk to you guys later. Bye.